Hello everyone and welcome back to this let's play for Banjo-Kazooie 100% uh, Today we are going to go to Treasure Trove Cove Which is the second world in this game uh, The first obviously being Mumbo's Mountain Which we just completed last time So we're going to head up here And there's going to be another note Well the very first note door really So you remember how we collected the notes on the last level? Well it turns out you only actually need 50 To get through this note door uh, but obviously you do want to get as many as you can Because you really do need them um, And by getting 100 we've just helped ourselves for later on I think the next door is probably like 100, 150, something like that uh, So yeah basically just try and get all the notes you can And we're going to Treasure Trove Cove and we're going to 100% it So let's uh, run through this door Take a bow, Banjo. You've done very well today. Good, pa good, good, good lad. Um, okay, so uh, this witch here is Gruntilda. Now, it's not Gruntilda at all. It's Brentilda, I think. But she's a, yeah, Brentilda. Yeah, she's a good witch. Now, Brentilda will help you by giving you advice throughout the game. She will tell you things about Gruntilda you might not want to know. But when she does, uh, you should probably write it down because you will be quizzed on the things that she tells you later. There's like a, um, what's it called? A, a mixed choice answer, a, you know, optional choice questions. And uh, yeah, you want to write that down. I've already got all the, the answers wrote down, so uh, I'm not really going to bother with that. But we're going to put some jiggy pieces to access Treasure Trove Cove. Um, there's another place, I think it's called Clanker's Canyon or something. Uh, that level's actually quite hard, it's mostly underwater. Well, not mostly, but a good 40% of it is underwater at least. Um, but yeah, there's Treasure Trove Cove, is now open for business. So, uh, let's see if we can find the way. I think down here, first of all, there is a cauldron, and that will act as a... Uh, warp point for later so You've activated a magic cauldron cool. So yeah, I need to find one more and that will activate the um, You know the warp point pretty handy actually from getting to different places quickly instead of uh, having to run all the way back through So we're now going to go to treasure trove cove, which is gonna be the object of today's episode We're gonna go right through treasure trove cove 100% that uh, so there is a note door up there, but I don't think we have enough to open it just yet, so I'm not really too worried about that. Uh, I also think there's another, uh, what point here somewhere? Yeah, there is, yeah. We're gonna activate that one, so you've activated a magic cauldron, cool. Find two of the same colour to create a shortcut. Fortunately, we, that won't take us, uh, to where we need to be. It's just, uh, there are, yeah, there are different cauldrons, basically. So, now, I'm gonna drop right down here, am I? Yeah, that's the only thing I can do now, really. So we're gonna drop down here. And up here. And we are going to go... I believe it's this way. So, we are going to head into Treasure Trove Cove, which I believe I just need to backflip into. There we are, great stuff. So this level, it's a bit like a piratey kind of world. Um, and as always, there is 100 notes, uh, the Jinjos, and uh, obviously the Jigsaw pieces. So we just saw one of the Jinjos down the bottom there, so I'm gonna try and get him now. There we are, that's the first one. So there is a shark in this level. If you go into the water, he will try and attack you. But, it is possible to actually uh, destroy the shark with eggs, but oh dear, well, what happened there? I'm not even sure if I got damaged there or not, probably didn't actually. But yeah, there's one of the Jinjos, uh, I might need some of his health actually. Um, oh no, yeah, cool, so when the talking animation was on, uh, I didn't get hurt, that's pretty cool. So there's a crab over this way, uh, let's see if we can uh, beat him. This is Nipper's Beach, find, you'll find nothing without Nipper's help, help us. 
Now, I think the way to beat this guy is to uh, climb on top of his shell. I'm really not sure about that, but there is a Mumbo token here. Let's see if we can get that. Um, let's see if we can figure out how to do this. Can't remember. Uh, maybe I shoot eggs at him. Oh, okay, so the eggs... Oh, yeah, I remember how to do this. You have to wait till he stops attacking. There we are. Okay, let's try that again. And maybe again, is it a three-time thing? There it is. Great stuff. Now we can climb inside a shell. And I'll use Kazooie's uh, Talon Trot. A little bit faster. So we'll go through here. It's a bit of a, like a spiral kind of a tunnel. And some eggs down here. And this is the first Jiggy of this level. So let's go see if we can find Jiggy number two. Uh, we'll just head back out of here. Uh, I think the next one I'll probably try and go for is the one on the ship. Where basically there's a pirate who has lost his gold. And uh, we can find it for him. Or at least I hope we can find it for him. Now there is a honeycomb down here that we're going to get. Uh, and of course there is the shark, so we'll have to be careful about that. Nice. Okay, there we are. That's our next uh, honeycomb. I'm going to try and get out of this water before he kills me. There we are. So that's the next honeycomb piece. So let's keep going. Um... Shouldn't need too much health for now, so we'll just move up to the ship area. So, this pirate up there, he's lost his gold. And what we're going to do is we're going to swim into there. I'm sorry, I'm very bad with these controls. And there's some notes down here, and this is what I'm after. One of his uh, gold pieces. Now, I am very bad, unfortunately, at controlling... Um, the underwater stuff. There we are. So I'm probably just going to be using A here to uh, go nice and slow. I can go up for some air if I do need it, uh, which I probably will end up having to do. It's like the controls, I think, are inverted. Yeah, I'm going to have to go up for some air. There we are. Okay. Yeah, the controls are like inverted, I think, or something. Um, it's actually quite difficult. Oh, seems to be easy at using B. Oh, very nice. Okay, so that's one of them done. Let's head back outside and we're going to head through another hole in the ship. Which is on the other side. And that shark isn't in this water. This is like a landlocked area apart from that water. So we don't need to worry about him. Uh, oh yeah, I'm just going to avoid that guy. Uh, right, okay, so let's see if I can remember how to... Oh yeah, it's this bit, isn't it? Nice. So again, we'll jump into the water. And there's a Mumbo token here as well. So let's see if we can get that. A few notes. I am very bad at controlling in the water. Oh, wow. This, this is not going well. Ah! Okay. Try that again. Go for the treasure. Great stuff. And the other Mumbo... I want to get that Mumbo token... We don't transform into anything on this world, but obviously you do want as many Mumbo tokens as you can get. Come on, nearly there. Oh, wow. There we are, and there's one more note down there. Obviously, we do want to get all 100 notes. Nearly got it. Okay, great stuff. So that's everything we can get in the bottom of the ship. We're now going to climb back on top. And we're gonna backflip out. So let's uh, now, oh, I just fell back in. Sorry about that. Okay, so we're gonna give him the gold and he uh, will reward us with a jigsaw piece. Just, uh, there's one. And we return his gold and he's uh, very happy. Nice. 
And there we have Jigsaw piece number two for this world. So, what we actually need to do now is, uh, just above us, there should be one of Bottles' mole hills, and we're going to talk to him. Uh, I'm actually going to get these notes first, actually. Um, I'm going to talk to Bottles, and he's going to teach us how to fly. He's going to teach us how to fly or jump. There's a Mumbo token there as well uh, that I want to get. So yeah, he's gonna teach us how to fly, and we got a few red feathers as well, which is also cool. But I believe there is a Jinjo just above us on that pole, so we're gonna climb up and get that too. And he's given us some feathers as well, isn't he nice? And he's filled up our health as well. Cool. Okay, so I'm gonna climb up here first of all, if I can. There we are. And there's a Jinjo. Okay, so let's have a quick look around the map. Refamiliarize ourselves with this. Uh, I do remember there is a sand castle somewhere along here. Um, so uh, it basically gives you the chance to get notes or something. Uh, let's see if we can remember how to do this. Ah, there we are. Okay, great stuff. So now we can fly. Isn't that awesome? Uh, I think there's a jiggy in here. Yeah, there is, yeah, so we're going to get that. Let's see if we can carefully backflip into here. Nice. So let's see if we can find another Jiggy. Uh, we'll go out of here. And I think I'm going to have to try and get back to land before Shark gets me. Great stuff. So I'm going to go back to that flying pad now. Uh, I want to see if we can have a look around the map. Maybe get some, oh, there's some notes there actually, let's get those notes, very important. Jump on here. Quite a lot of notes actually, yeah, obviously. Um, so I could probably use the, no actually, let's go get some notes first of all. We do need all 100, so. Climb up here, we'll do the fly pad thing a little bit later. There is that mumbo token that I need to get as well. But we can always come back here. Let's jump up here. Great stuff. So, there's another tutorial here. Uh, before I do that, I'm going to get these notes. And the fly pad, we can probably use that later as well. Oh, I fell down. Now, that bucket I actually needed. Um, I believe that drains the water level, which allows us to uh, get into the castle. In fact, yeah, we'll just do this now. So yeah, now we have the jump pads. Don't really need them um, if you can fly, but you know, they're still useful. We've learned all the moves in Treasure Trove Cove. Very nice. Uh, I'm going to do this first. Uh, so what we want to do is shoot some eggs into his bucket. Okay, there we are. And patch up eggs with uh, bottles, apparently. Great stuff. And this is how we're going to get our next Jiggy. So, uh, we'll jump down here. And see if we can backflip on top of the castle. And we can't, actually. Huh. I didn't think this through. Really should have got those uh, notes before I did that, really. It's okay though, we can get them using the jump pad and stuff, so don't worry about that. Okay, so the object of this is to spell out Banjo-Kazooie on the wall. You can see there, Banjo-Kazooie. Uh, we're going to get these notes. Great stuff. Okay, let's see if we can find this. Uh, B A N Where's J? is J. Ah, there it is. Banjo. Oh. I remember I did this once. I spelt it wrong, even though it's on the wall. Uh, so it's Banjo. And then we're looking for Kazooie. Now, I believe you can actually use this to uh, enter cheats and stuff. But I don't want to really be using any cheats. Uh, 
Z or Z. There it is. O. Uh, there should be another O somewhere. There it is. And I. And E. Great stuff. But I I don't know. I don't think I don't think this crab can actually be killed. Uh, I think he's invincible. But we're just gonna ignore him anyway. Oh, I think. Get out of my way, you stupid crab. Right, let's see if we can finish him off. There we are. Now we'll get a honeycomb. And that's the next jiggy. Oh, I love that music. So, let's get the hell out of here. And uh, I might do the flying one next. Or I might do the jumping one next. Uh, one of those two. Uh, yeah, like I say, I kind of messed up on getting the notes. I should have got them before I, um, I drained the water. But it's okay, you can still get them. we will probably get them later on. Not to worry at all. Right, let's go. Yeah, we'll do the jumping one next. It seems pretty close. Jump up here, up here. Okay, so these are the jump pads, but we don't need to be on that one. We want to be on this one over here. And I'm going to try, I say try, uh, to jump across here. Oh, wow, okay. I That was actually an accident. Um, it's just lucky that went well, to be honest. Can we jump straight up in the air? I don't actually know. Oh, we can. Excellent. Okay, good stuff. And we jump across to the next one. And we fell down. Fantastic. <laughs> oh, dear. Right, let's try that one again. Head up here. Uh, yeah, just getting used to the controls and stuff, you know. Sometimes it happens. Really nothing to worry about, though. Okay, let's try this again. Um... Jump across. You can always use Kazooie's flap to um, just give you a little bit of security. Feel like you're not going to make it. So there's a Jinjo over there. There's notes over there. I'm not going to go over there yet because there's a, like an X marks the spot kind of game where you have to find all the X's uh, that I'm going to be doing over there later. We'll get these feathers. Like I say, you can just fly. Uh, but why not use the jump pads, you know? They're there for a reason. Might as well use them. Let's see if we can do this. Nice. And only one more. Oh, we got this. Yeah, nice. Okay. Oh. Great stuff. That's our next uh, jiggy. So, uh, the next one, just trying to think, uh, is Ginger over there, we'll leave him for now, I'm going to get him later, don't worry, he will be rescued, now I'm going to get these notes, and make sure we get them all, good stuff, a little bit of waiting here while we backflip out, there's another chest here, I don't, I think this has notes in it, but I'm going to have a look anyway. Oh, it has red feathers. Okay, we definitely need red feathers for flying, especially in this level, so always good to have. Uh, we'll go up here. And let's see if we can get across here. Good stuff. So I, th I remember there being a jiggy here somewhere, like really difficult to find. I think it's on that ledge over there somewhere. Um... But first, I'm going to have a look up here and see what we can find. And of course, that happened because I'm an idiot. Let's try that again. There's a life down there, which is pretty sweet. Okay, that, that shouldn't have happened. Let's pretend that didn't happen and try again. Uh, okay, yeah, the shark's just going to constantly chase me and he's gone. Okay, good stuff. Yeah, I really shouldn't have fell off there. I don't really know what happened. I'm going to go up the top here. I hope it's not the um, the bit where you have to battle the chest. really hope it's not. No, it's not. Okay, oh, this is this my first X? I have to get. It could be. 
Yeah, it is. Okay, so it's telling me to go that way. Should we just do that now? Or maybe not. I actually wasn't intending on doing this yet. Um, I know there's like a jiggy around here and stuff. But yeah, you know what? Why not? We'll, we'll get the next one. So, Kazooie can fly uh, as long as uh, they want, really. Oh, can I get that? Oh, just missed him. All right, we'll get him later. So, we'll hit the X. Oh, totally missed. And, yeah, you get more feathers anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Fly over the next one. And there's actually some notes here I've missed, so I want to get them. And I keep missing that for some reason. Now, it's not a timed thing. Once you hit it, you can just walk away and do other things if you want to. Uh, I kind of feel, though, like I'm going to end up missing a few notes. Uh, oh, what's in here? Let's look. Have I already been in here or not? I don't remember. Oh, wow. I'm about to die, actually. Uh, let's see what's in there. Oh, it's a mumbo token. Yeah, we definitely want one of them. Oh, it was just eggs. I thought it was a mumbo token. Oh dear. Okay, that didn't go well. I flip out. So yeah, I'm actually surprised I'm close to death here. More notes. I'm going to get as many notes as I can in the same area. Or moving on to the next bit. Uh, it looks to be all the notes. This is basically back where I started. Uh, there is some health down there, but... Yeah, we'll go get we'll go get the health because we uh, we actually kind of need it. I'm pretty close to death, to be fair. So it's still oh no, that's not good. Okay, he just cost me a health, so uh, we'll kill him. Take that, great stuff. I don't think enemies respawn, but once their honeycomb pieces uh, spawn, I don't think they disappear. So it's really not too bad. So let's go get the next. Um, the next X. And I'm going to have to fly across to that mysterious island out in the distance eventually as well. Um, not sure why, I just nearly fell off there. Um, let's see if we can... We'll do this first. We could even just jump down and get them notes there, which I was meaning to get. And I miss it every time, I don't know why. Probably because I'm terrible. Uh, okay, here we go. And um, we see a mumbo token there. We definitely want to get that. And I totally missed it. That's okay. We'll try again. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, okay, we got it. There is actually another one. Um, it's just up here. So, oh, anyway, you can climb up and get that. So, yeah, don't really need to do that. Um, right, where should we go now? Yeah, we'll, we'll do this one. Oh, I was I was trying to like pound on him there, but that didn't work. And that didn't even trigger the X thing. Okay, there we are. So, I think a chest is going to appear now. Uh, I think so anyway. And I haven't really got a lot of Jinjos here, have I? So, that's a little bit concerning. So, there's a question mark, and that's because the real X is down on the floor there. I'll get these notes while I can. And there's Jinjo that I want to get, so hopefully I won't mess this up. Hey, nice one. Great stuff. So, um, don't really need to jump up there now. Do need to jump over here. Oh, uh, we nearly died there. Okay, you don't want to be dying, so there's one. I'm going to leave the other honeycomb in case I get hurt. So, let's see if we can kill this guy. There we are. And that's our next jigsaw piece. So, um, I'm going to leave that. Oh, there's another mumbo token there. Let's go ahead and get that. And I'm going to go back to the ship. Because I would like to get the mumbo token that I missed. And I'll probably use a fly pad or something um, to have a look around the map. Seems like the best thing to do, but first of all, let's climb up here. Totally forgot you could actually do that. 
Uh, there we are, Mumbo Token. Sweet. Gonna need lots of them. Uh, right, let's go back up and we're gonna have to fly around the map. I believe there's like a uh, doorway somewhere that leads to... I think it's it's one of these two little alcove areas. I know it is, but I'm not sure which. Uh, could be that one, but I'm going to actually go for that last. Uh, my reasoning is I feel like there is a jiggy around just this bit here. And I'm going to try and fly to it. It's just going to be easier, I think. Is it here? Uh, it could be here, couldn't it? No, it's not there. Okay, so if it's not there, where is it? Is it across here? Uh, not here. Sir, it's around here somewhere. Ah, there it is. Cool. Nice, that's G number seven for this world. So the next one... Uh, could actually just go to that bit where I was going to go before. I'll try and backtrack as much as I can here. Because um, there are some notes that I need to get, actually. I uh, hope I don't mess this up. Very careful. And I may even need to backflip up there. In fact, I probably will. Uh, just to play it safe. Get some more red feathers. Because there was actually some notes around here. So we're going to need to get them before we do anything else. Notes are obviously very important. Can I, can I get them? Yep, there we are. There we are, great stuff. Oh, fell off. Okay, though. And um, we can't forget the notes on top of the castle as well. Very important that we get them. Uh, if I had some skill, I could probably walk up the side of these uh, stairs, but I don't seem to be able to do that. Okay, there we are, we got them. Oh dear. And I wonder what's in there. Oh, two Mumbo tokens, very handy. Nice, I felt like, I felt like I should have been hurt there. I don't know. Cool. Yeah, two Mumbo tokens for the price of one. Very nice. Get these. Oh, and we fell off again. Yeah, you can actually just walk up the side. Uh, if you have enough skill, obviously I don't. Cool. Uh, I think there's a Jinjo down there. No, oh, it's Jiggy. Okay. Uh, can we destroy that? I feel like I should be able to destroy that somehow. No, apparently not. Okay, that's fine. I was certain there was a way to do that. But that's okay. Probably is a way to do it, uh, but matter. So, get that. Yeah, that's G number eight. I feel like there's definitely a way to destroy that mine. Um, or maybe it just blows up when it hits you. I don't really know. Uh, there is another ginger over there as well. So let's go get him now. Um, very careful. I uh, really should have got him when I was flying, to be honest, but never mind. We get him. Nice. There's another Jinjo. Um, I feel like there's ways of destroying these guys. Just can't seem to remember how to do it. Did that work? Oh, okay, you don't really get anything for it. Okay, fair enough. But there is a crab down there with some notes. I stamp on him. Okay. So he is eluding me, but that's okay. Don't really need to kill him anyway. Health there as well if I need it. Wait, oh, okay, okay, it is on. Nice. So we got those. Uh, we'll leave that health there. Is the Jinjo down the bottom there? Oh, it's a Mumbo token. Definitely use that. Oh, yeah, you know what? That didn't actually hurt too much, to be fair. I'm going to leave the red feathers, get the mumbo token. Always handy. Don't really need all them red feathers. Okay, so how many biggies do I have in this world? Not enough, I'll tell you that much. 
and there's still more notes and stuff to get. I'm actually gonna fly to the upper level now and see if I can get the last. Oh no, actually, let's go for a honeycomb. Yeah, let's do that. There's one over here on this lonely island. Feel like that anyway. Um, but where is it? Life there. Ah, I, I could have sworn there was a, a honeycomb. Or is it somewhere else? Let's just have a look around. I was certain it was on that island. It might be on a different one. Oh, is that it? There it is. Let's see if we can fly into it. Oh, we missed it. Can we spin around for another go? Yeah, we'll have to be very careful here. Doesn't really matter if we land on uh, land in the water. Ah, oh, you know what? I haven't got the skill. We're gonna land in the water. That's okay. Uh, the, the only reason I didn't want to land in the water is basically because I want to keep flying, but that's okay. We can get to land pretty quickly uh, without too much trouble. There we are. So I'm going to go back to a flying pad. Um, yeah, we'll go back to the ship because there is another jiggy that I definitely know how to get. And I think there's a Jinjo up there as well that I'm going to need. Obviously for one of my jigsaw pieces, so fly up here. And it's through this one. This is the place I've been avoiding so far. But now we can go here. So this will take us up here. And I think there's some red feathers up there. There's a Jinjo. Uh, might have to be careful here, actually. Oh, wow, okay. So he, he eats your eggs, yeah, okay, good for him. Not really worried about him. Um, right, let's let's have a look here. Pause. I think. There's definitely, obviously, we, we've seen the Jinjo. These guys jump, that's crazy. Like, they jump all the way up there, that's mad. So, let's see if we can get up here. Okay, I nearly fell there, actually. I might have just taken a shortcut there, I'm not really too sure. So can we do this? Um, how do we do this again? Is it... Not that. Uh, is it B? Hey, and there's a Mumbo token as well. Awesome. Notes up here. Is there not a G? Oh, there is a G. Yeah, cool, cool, cool. 92 notes so far. Very nice. Uh, oh. Yeah, it must have to jump up here, I guess, uh, using the jump pad. And there we have our next jigsaw piece. I'll have to go back and get that Jinjo there, and that should be the last Jinjo on this level. And, coincidentally, it'll also be the last jigsaw piece on this level. So, you know, two birds and one stone, you know. If I don't mess this up anyway. So, there is always that to consider. There's some notes. Oh, yeah, and obviously... Uh, you know what? I actually forgot that was there, so it's a good thing I saw it. Great stuff. Um, probably want to play this safe, head back down slowly. Although it might be easier just to fly across to the Jinjo, or jump across to the Jinjo. I have missed a few notes. We know where they are, though, don't we? It's, they're on top of the uh, castle over there that we can see. So, very careful here. And there's our last Jinjo. Nice. So, I've got the last of the notes. Uh, I've got both honeycombs. And that'll be the end of the level. So, it's just down there. Um, let's see if we can actually, oh, wow, that hurt. Okay, let's just fly across. I really should have got these when the water was still uh, around the castle, but never mind. So, see if we can 
Okay, that was close actually. I nearly missed that. And one more. And that is all of the notes on this world. And that's all the jiggies on this world as well. So there is one more bonus note to get, which I am uh, going to show you guys. Sorry, one more jigsaw piece. I'm going to show you guys how to get that just now. Get your best note score for this world. Nice. Uh, I'm going to yeah, kill him. Don't want to be killed. Uh, right. So we jump up here, up here, up here, here, and ca cannon shot over there. I get some more health as well, actually. I'm pretty low. Pretty low on health at the minute, unfortunately. Yeah, we'll leave that just in case. Not this one. Just have to jump on here. Backflip. Probably just ignore him. Get some feathers if I need them. And this is the hidden G. And that is everything for today's episode, guys. I want to thank you all very much for watching today. Please like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Leave any comments if you do have any. And me, Banjo and Kazooie, will see you guys next time. Take care.